Hey everybody. If you can't tell, I'm using my new camera. I feel like such a pro YouTuber right now. And I can see myself in the little camera and it's so crazy. Hey everybody. But today is fun because we are going thrift shopping. I just got ready. This is my outfit. Let me just... Leg warmers, keep me cozy. Yeah, and I'm gonna meet up with my friend Ema and then we're gonna go charity shopping. It's really hot in here, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ema, <laughs> hey! Oh. I have a check. <laughs> so literally the first thing I came across were these cowboy boots and I was like, oh my god, I love a cowboy boot. This was gorgeous light brown colour, I loved it. It was sadly a size 3 and I'm a size 5 so I had to put them back which was really upsetting. I just love the like worn and westerny look that these ones had but yeah, I had to put them back. There was some nice jewellery in here as well. I love this little circular, I don't know what you'd call it but that was a pretty necklace. Nice little beachy bag too. I always recommend going to charity shops if you're looking for a cool and unique bag or unique jewellery. They are just the perfect place for it. And Emma found this nice grey jacket and I don't even know why I picked this pink jumper up. Put it back, not a bit me. Had a little look at the jumpers. I'm never really that lucky when it comes to the jumper section, but I really liked this blue jumper. It does give very much granny vibes, but I thought it had so much potential, but um, it was just really long. If it wasn't that long, probably would have got it. And I've actually been looking for a fur gilet recently. It has never been something that I've liked, but I saw someone wearing it recently and it actually looked really cute with the way she styled it. So I'm on the hunt for one now. And looking back at this one now, I'm so gutted I didn't get it. It was 12 pounds and I searched it up online when I got home and they sell for like a hundred quid. Not happy, but it was just, obviously, as you can see, it was massive on me. So I put it back. You can always normally find cool, unique belts in charity shops as well. I found this cool red one. I thought it was pretty unique, but put it on and I hated it. Immediately took it off was not what I was thinking. I'm also on the hunt for like a little red baby tee. Um, I thought this had potential, looked pretty good. Tried it on and it's like the size of me. So not fitting the baby tee vibe, put that back. And these next few videos are a bit funny because I accidentally put my GoPro in time-lapse. So I've had to slow it down. So the video is a bit jumpy, sorry about that. But anyway, I found this red fleece, also on the hunt for a red fleece. What's with me in red right now? Don't know, love it. But I thought this was cute. It was in the men's section, so I expected it to be a bit big, and I kind of wanted it to be an oversized fit, but it was just not giving me that. It just looked like it didn't fit me, so put that back. And then I actually found the perfect fur gilet. Um, I don't actually know how you say that word, but I hope I said it right. Um, I love this. I thought it was just such a nice colour and like a good amount of cropped. I love that. So I tried it on. Hey, Emma. And then this is what it looked like. I really liked it. And when I can't decide on something, I always have to like put on my jacket or my bag that I've got with me to kind of see how I would wear it out and then Emma found this nice t-shirt it had a really cool print on the back love that very cool and I spent so long in front of this mirror I could not decide whether to get this or not but I did buy it it was 5 99 which I thought was a risk worth taking checked out the bag section and I always find good stuff in the bag section that is where you go sometimes you have to dig for it but you always end up with something cool like this bag. I loved it. Just like the two different materials and the shape was beautiful. Tried that on, absolutely loved it. I think this was only like 4 99 so, you know, I had to get it. And obviously spent ages in the mirror deciding because I'm so indecisive, but yes, bought it. And in the next shop, I found this black buckle wallet. I thought that was really cool. And I'm actually looking for a new wallet and I think this was about 1 99 or 2 99 so that was a bargain and I bought that. Found a nice basic white pair of joggers, which is always good to have, but they looked a bit skinny and I love an oversized fit with joggers, so I didn't get them. And in the next shop, I found another fur gilet and I loved the fact that it wasn't fur on the back, it was just fur on the front. And I actually really like this one as well, even though I just bought the other one. So you already know this was a long decision to make, but I decided not to get it. I just bought the other one, which I like as well, so I put that back. Had a little rummage through the top section, but didn't find anything. I did come across this nice brown bag. I love the shape of it. I thought it was so nice, but it just wasn't something I needed today. And another gilet, but like a puffery one this time. Thought that was cool. Emma spotted this like fishnet-y tan top, which I thought was really cool. So I went to try that on. I had a little look at the top section while I was there. I'm just really looking for the red tops right now, but I didn't find anything, sadly. And looked at the jewelry section, of course. I loved this one. It was like a little silver wine bottle. Thought that was so cute. And this red one was absolutely stunning. Love that so much. Then I tried on that tan top and I was very much umming and ahhing. I really wasn't sure if it was my sort of thing. I didn't know if I just didn't like the colour. I felt like it washed me out a bit. So I put on my black jumper and I think it made all the difference. I liked it now. So yeah, sometimes you just have to imagine the outfit. But I bought that. That was £4.50. And I like checking out the homeware section for like cool glasses or like breakfast glasses. And then I found this fur jacket and I would never really go for something like this. But I kept it with me to try on. And I like the look of this like beigey windbreaker sort of jacket. So I kept that with me to try on too. I like this red handbag. I thought it had really pretty stitching on the 
the handle. They made it feel all beachy and summery to me, but I wasn't really in love with it, so I put it back. Found a nice white scarf. Charity shops are always good for different kinds of scarves as well, if you're looking for that. This one was just too much of a thin material for me. This is the beigey jacket I picked up earlier. It was nice, but I already have a similar one, so I didn't really need that. And oh my god, I could not believe this jacket. I never would wear something like this, but I just absolutely loved it. I thought it was so perfectly oversized, and I love the chunky collar on it. It was just so cozy and fluffy, and I loved it, so I had to get that. It was £4.50, so I couldn't say no to that. And they also have some cool razor jackets in here. These used to be my vibe, but they just aren't bit me anymore, so left them. And I know I left that bag earlier, but this was just so pretty. I think it was just the stitching that did it for me. It was just such a pretty contrast. But I did put it back, which I kind of regret now, because it was only £6.99, and it was gorgeous. But then I found this silver chromey handbag, which I thought was so cool. I've never been a massive fan of silver, but I've seen people styling it recently, and I actually really like it. Thought it would look really cool with like a going out evening outfit, so I bought that. It was only £4.99. And into the next shop, I found this jumper, which I thought was a bit weird, but kind of cool. Like the colour, I'd never really seen a colour like that. But holding it up, I was like, ooh, this is not a bit of me. So I put that back. And also go to charity shops for leather jackets. Emma found this amazing, like, short leather jacket. I love the collar on it. I would have 100% bought it if I didn't already have a similar one. It was only £10, which is such a bargain. And the thrifted leather jacket I already have was like £35, so that was an insane price. And I got so excited when I saw this. I thought it was like a brown gilet but it was like a brown cord mini dress, so I put that back. And carried on my little search around the shop, and I found this fleecy cream zip-up with like the black outline. I thought that was really nice. So I tried that on, and I don't know why the lighting's done this. I'm sorry, but um, it was also huge on me, so I put that back. And what did I say about charity shops and leather jackets? This is another one. Gorgeous. This was only £10 as well. What a steal. Another little checkered print inside as well. Now this shop had some lovely jewellery. Very cool pieces. Emma found this red like circular one. Loved that. And I found this silver multi-circle one. Which I tried on. It was a bit big. But I thought it could be a really cool statement. And I imagined it with like a little tube top. Which just sold it for me. So I bought that. And then I stumbled across this black midi skirt. I loved the back of it. Tried it on. It also has some cool little zips on the side. And I just loved it. I thought it was a perfect fit. And so I bought that for only £4. Hey everybody, Emma. Hello. <laughs> oh, I love that one. It's mm. red. It's so pretty. Hey, ASMR. <laughs> so beautiful. <laughs> I love this one. Same. Where's the red one? Here she is in all her glory. Ooh. It's the next day. We're back in my room now. I got my hair done this morning as well. I got my roots redone, so feeling great. I thought I would just give you a final look at everything that I bought when we went try shopping. Also, my room is a big fat mess. Please do not look at it. Um, I have this massive bag on my chair because I just opened this and set it up. I bought a new ring light for my phone. <gasps> Gorgeous. Amazing, but um, yeah, I'll give you a final look. So, one of the things I bought I'm wearing now, this was £1.50. I'm gonna tighten it up higher, but I can't even bother right now. So yeah, that's one thing. I got this bag, which is actually the most gorgeous bag in the entire world. It's so shiny here, and then this is so beautiful. So, I love this. This was 4 99 you know, absolute bargain. The second bag that I got was this silver bag. I thought it was so cool, like, I've been seeing a lot of silver going around recently, like, and I've never really been a silver girl, I've always been a, oh, I'm not wearing any gold, I've always been a gold girl, but I thought I would really embrace the metallic -y silver vibe, which, you know, you can see on my nails here. So, yeah, got this, this was 4 99 as well, absolute bargain. I never normally go for something like this, I'm just like, it's not a bit of me, but I just absolutely loved it, I loved the oversizedness of it, the oversizedness. Like, I love the massive collar, and it was like four pounds, which is an absolute bargain. And it's really cozy and warm, so love that. I did get this, which I'm not gonna try on because I can't be bothered, but um, little fishnet top, which I thought was really cute. It just needs a bit of styling. Like, I don't love it when it's on, but when I like put jewelry over it and put a nice cool bag on, it looks cool, so. I love this as well. I love my little midi skirts right now. Having a little midi skirt moment. The front was cute and I was like, oh, that's nice. And then I looked at the back and I love this like little circular thing going on and the little zips in the corner. So I love that. Very cute. This was four pounds. Got this little wallet that I actually need because my wallet is currently ripped and I'm lucky that all my bank cards haven't fallen out. So I got this. It's got all the compartments that I could ever want. One ninety nine. 
what more can I want? Got this fur gilet. Gilet? 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 Never, I would normally be like, that looks so ugly. Like, who is wearing this? Me, I'm wearing it now. I watched a YouTube video the other day and, and they were wearing this and I was like, oh, hang on. That actually looks quite cute. So I went on the hunt for one and I found this. It does look a bit weird, but I feel like if I style it right, it could be really cute. Like it's got a little clip here. So yes, feeling this. That's the last thing I got. I thought that's the last thing I got. So that concludes my little thrifting haul. Hope you enjoyed it. Also the first time using this GoPro, so I might have messed up all my videos. I have no idea until I watch it all back. So um hope it all worked out all right. I hope you guys notice an actual difference with the filming quality as well. Tell me you do. Tell me you do. Because I feel so swag right now. I feel like a... I feel like a little YouTuber. Yeah, I will take you along on my next thrifting charity shopping day. And until then, goodbye! Mwah.